Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's that time again. Seems like only yesterday that I took up a champion, but now I'm about to do another one. And we don't have that much time left in the level up, uh, so place your guesses. Who do you think I'm going to rank up right now? Leave a comment, let me know, but we are about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. Yes, Ebony Maw. All right, so let's go ahead and rank them up. You see I have a one to two generic. I'm saving it. Uh, and I opened up just three of the crystals, T4 CC crystals, and I was able to get all the mystics that I needed. So let's go ahead and rank him up. All right, now, uh, don't have a lot of time, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, grab that, and then we'll just keep grabbing the uh, Mystic. Uh, but the reason that I am taking him up right now is that he is one of three champions that are getting a rework. And we've already gone over his uh, details, and he looks good. Now, he may not be you know, everything that he looks like on paper, but he looks really good. And it's not really going to hurt me that much if uh, I take him to rank two. Now, whether he goes to rank three, that will depend on his numbers and uh, what kind of damage it looks like he can do. So uh, we also have a mystic advancement that just hit. So we have like nine minutes uh, or less in the level up and so i wanted to make sure i got this done very very quickly uh so that i don't miss getting all the milestones in the level up and i had actually uh said to myself and it's a little game that i play uh i let the advancement determine you know what class i use so uh i was looking at any of the three champions okay i have all three War Machine, Ebony Maw, um, hold on, let me see here. Okay, yeah, uh, War Machine, Ebony Maw, and um, boom, Ultron. All right, so I actually have a tech rank up gem that would have been used for Ultron if it had been a tech advancement that hit. So that's what we would have done. We're not gonna take a look at him right now, um, actually, you know what? Let's take a look at him uh, because this is all before his rework. So this can serve as a reference point. All right, so you can see all of this. Um, but this will serve as a reference point to uh, what he looked like before the rework. Uh, he's not awakened. All right, let's see. And... Uh, We'll be able to compare him uh, later. Uh, but anyway, so uh, the game that I was playing, if it had been a tech advancement, Ultron would have gone up. Uh, if it was Mystic, I was going to do Ebony Maw. And uh, if it was, um, see, Ebony Maw, um, if it was, uh, well, actually, I'm trying to think, because there's two techs, because War Machine also, but I would have taken up Ultron over War Machine. Uh, but I might have taken both of them up since I had a tech, um, rank up gem. So I may have used a gem on one of them and then taken the other one up, uh, during a tech advancement. Uh, so we might've had a double. All right. Uh, but Ebony Maw looks good. We don't know how his rework is going to be. Uh, I'm not going to do the, uh, gameplay right now. So I'm recording this part when we just have uh, a little bit left, let me show you guys what I mean. See, we got four minutes left in the level up, but we have all of the uh, milestones. Uh, I don't have anybody else that I really want to level up, so I'm not going for uh, the one to 10% or whatever. Um, but as you can see, the Mystic Advancement, not all the way, but I'll use some uh, signature stones and stuff like that to get that uh, all the milestones. But it just hit. I waited, set an alarm, hoping that I would get an advancement, 
and I did. So I was able to double dip. Uh, four minutes left. We're good. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. All right. So next time I see you, uh, it will be after Ebony Maw's rework. And then we will take him for a spin, probably in a Realm of Legends, and test out the damage of the new Ebony Maw. All right. So see you soon. All right. So the buff is now live. So we're going to take him into Realm of Legends. You can see I only have Ebony Maw, no synergies active. I do have Suicides on. He is not a suicide friendly champion. Uh, I don't know the best way to play him, but we're going to play around with him right now uh, for the first time here. All right, so he has three missions, and I'm going to try to get all the missions done. All right, so... Let's see. One mission I can get, I believe, with the heavy attack. Soon as uh, Winter Soldier lets me do that. Alright, so that's one mission. And then I'm going to fire off special one. Gives him a fury since he didn't have one. Fire off another one. That nullifies it. That's the second mission. There we go, and that's the third one. He missed while I had Falter up. All right, so that's all the missions done. And let's uh, see if we can hit him with a special two while he is Faltered. And the damage is not too bad. All right, here we go. Don't know if I got that one just right, but uh, he seems to be, mm, I don't know. I love his animations, and he always felt smooth to play. The only thing missing was his damage. Now, my Ebony Maw, as you can see, is not awakened. Not having him awakened see that one okay yeah not having him awakened means he doesn't get the dgens when uh he misses you know uh when a soldier would have had a dgen on you know every time he misses like this if he was awakened he would have gotten dgen let's uh build up to a special three all right come on All right, let's fire that off. Now, his special three does a power drain and a power gain. So, uh, however much power he had, it's going to drain it. And, uh, yep, see, we got a power gain buff. And we are going to get that same amount that was drained. There you go. Over time. All right, so now. Come on. Yeah, he did that because he knew. Winter Soldier is really funny in, in Realm of Legends. All right, let's uh, wait out the falter. You know, because if he has something on him, he's going to fire off his special. There we go. Um, to delay things. Okay, so the D-Gen is pretty good. Um, not crazy. Better than he was before. For sure. And keep in mind that I am running suicide. So the damage that you're seeing here uh, is inflated. Okay, let's see if we can get him again with another uh, special two. While he's faltered. And he's down. Alright, so. My first impressions are he is much improved but i'm not likely to take him to rank three rank two sure if i want to use him on defense if he ever gets awakened sure but yeah offensively even though he is greatly improved i don't really see him 
being the rank up choice uh, for anyone. You can see uh, we put in 173 hits. Now that is with uh, suicides on. And again, he's not suicide friendly. Um, I did get three hits, but yeah, his damage is, is, is much improved, but it's not anything to write home about. Uh, let me know what you think uh, in the comments below. Do you think his damage is really, really good? Or is it just okay? You know, we all know it's better than it was before, but what do you think about the damage as I've seen so far? I did all the missions. Uh, he's not awakened, so there's some degen uh, damage that is missing, but should give you a good idea of the damage he's capable of. All right, so leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. Uh, take care. If you haven't subscribed to me already, feel free to give me a subscription. Don't forget to hit the like button. Really helps me out. Take care, and you all have a blessed day.